All right, I've got this Manico right here, 11 inch cowl, which that's not too important in this little video here. We're in this custom upper Ferris limits. I'm in all terrain, low conductor. See that old big nail there? Okay, so I'm in custom two here. Okay, and you see that number there, 16. Ferris limit says 16. And I'm gonna start letting that up. See what I'm doing there? And the nail starts coming in. But see that number up at 20. Okay, and remember that, 20. I'm gonna back out of here. I'm going over to preset. Okay, now upper ferris limit's five. I'm gonna let that up to seven. Okay, you hear the machine, not too much on the nail. Six, a little bit, five, four. So here's the $64,000 question. I've got a four there, you see that. I go over here into the custom two. And I got different numbers over here. Why? You know, the default programs on this machine are set up for the actual preset. When I go to custom, I'm getting a different set of numbers. So why don't they correspond? And if the custom allows for finer, finer incremental settings, then why didn't they use why didn't they use the same numbers and use decimal points? You see that where I'm at right now? See there? Let me go back to the top. See there? I'm in 18. You know, so it's, you know, this is, looks like to me this could have been made a lot simpler. I mean, this, this 21 there correspond with four in the preset screen? Well, that don't make a lot of sense. And if I let these all the way down, okay, I get down to zero there. So zero is there in the custom, okay. And if I get out of here and go back to the preset, zero is up here at the top. It's backwards. Why is that? I mean, why don't they keep the number system the same? And if it is a finer adjustment using the custom, use decimal points like 5.5 and the custom would come in between 5 and 6 on the preset. So, you know, you start using this machine in the custom, you know, you're going to be thrown for a little bit of a loop there. And you have to do trial and error. I mean, I guess a person could say, well, I can look at that screen... You know, I can I can look at that screen, you know, and maybe get an idea of what what that is right there. See how that's dropped down? I mean, that sort of looks like four of the preset, don't it? But I mean, I don't know that. I mean, I'm guessing. You see what I'm saying? Could this be fixed with an update? I don't know, but this. This is uh, this is sort of confusing, I think, for folks. The target ID part's pretty simple there. I get that part. But that Ferris limit in that custom there's I don't know. I just thought I'd share. I hope you enjoyed.